Hello, I'm LEGO17 here, and today I'll be doing a review on my custom LEGO side-loading garbage truck. I was inspired to build this after watching Lionon's video on his side-loading garbage truck, and I have uh, kind of based this somewhat off of his. Uh, the cab design looks the same as his, and the side-loading part is somewhat similar. Uh, in the way that it picks up the trash can, but the, it's far different from his in other ways. So, uh, let's get started with the cab. It's, I don't know much information about what the, the real life term for this type of cab is, but um, it's more forward and has the wheels kind of back more. Yeah. <laughs> I, so I have the grill, headlights. Bumper, uh, these mirrors that uh, this is how I like to do my mirrors on larger vehicles like this. Uh, very simple, but nice looking technique. Uh, on this side, um, you can see the gas tank and the uh, and a couple of things like um, uh, I got broom and shovel. I don't know why I couldn't think of the name. Uh, down here on either side, uh, there's this extra little wheel. It's just for detail. It doesn't actually uh, go down to the ground. Um, and uh, I kind of just used parts from the, I think it was like 2016, maybe, um, like front loading garbage truck. Uh, I want to make a front-loading garbage truck in the future, but for now, this is all I really need. Um, either side has this sticker. The back has some detailing with some stickers. Also, as you can probably see, this hinge is open. And also, this whole assembly hinges down. So, uh, yeah, now let's talk about the actual side-loading part. I'm just going to move this back and introduce this, which is meant to represent like the kind of the curb and sidewalk in a neighborhood. So I have some garbage pieces that I'll just fill this trash can up with. Okay, I put a few in there. So, oops, not the tripod. So, the first thing would be that oh, I can't really see that. Um, but this would go out and kind of down because of hinge right there. Uh, okay, uh, because of those hinges. And then it would kind of cling on like that. And I'm just going to loosen this. And go back up. And the garbage would go in. Sometimes it doesn't quite go in. And go back down and return it. And just go back like that and then move on to the next house. One thing that's different from Lionon's design that I don't have in mind is a compacting section right here. I just have a ramp down there so gravity and momentum I guess will put them in the back. Also if I just do that. Uh, so like I said this can go up and just dump out everything in the back. Uh, in there, I just, or in the cab section, uh, it's a really scratched up windshield. I just have a minifigure that came in the Lego movie, a garbage truck set. Uh, right here, behind the cab, I just have some little detailing to represent a smokestack, and I don't even know what this wheels or, or the steering wheel piece is supposed to represent it. I, I just need to put something there and I felt that it was good enough. And 
I don't think there's much else to say about this. Uh, so, again, this was really uh, a lot of it based off of Lion, or I guess now he's called Zane Bricks, or some, something close to that. So, check out his video on his side of the garbage truck. If I figure out how to add a link in the description and I remember, I will try. Other than that, please like, comment, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.